Mastering Deep Learning Deep Learning revolutionizes data creation with GANs and BOS that forge unreal samples indistinguishable from reality. What role does deep learning play in the development and application of generative models, such as generative adversarial networks, GANs, and variational autoencoders, VAS, and how are its techniques leveraged to generate new and unique data samples that resemble existing ones? Deep learning plays a pivotal role in the development and application of generative models, such as generative adversarial networks, GANs, and variational autoencoders, VAS. These models are designed to generate new and unique data samples that resemble existing ones, demonstrating remarkable capabilities in various domains, including computer vision, natural language processing, and audio synthesis. In the context of generative models, deep learning techniques are leveraged to learn complex patterns and representations from large datasets. This is achieved through the use of neural networks, which are trained on existing data to capture underlying distributions and relationships. The learned patterns and representations are then used to generate new data samples that resemble the original data. GANs, in particular, have revolutionized the field of generative modeling. The GAN architecture consists of two neural networks, a generator network and a discriminator network. The generator network takes a random noise vector as input and produces a synthetic data sample, while the discriminator network evaluates the generated sample and determines its authenticity. Through an adversarial process, the generator network learns to produce more realistic data samples, and the discriminator network becomes more proficient in distinguishing between real and generated samples. This adversarial process enables GANs to generate highly realistic data samples that are often indistinguishable from real data. VAS, on the other hand, are a type of generative model that uses a probabilistic approach to generate new data samples. VAS consist of an encoder network which maps the input data to a lower dimensional latent space, and a decoder network, which generates new data samples from the latent space. The VA is trained to maximize the likelihood of the input data and to minimize the difference between the input data and the generated data. This allows VAs to learn a probabilistic representation of the data distribution, enabling them to generate new data samples that resemble the original data. Deep Learning Techniques, such as Convolutional Neural Networks, CNNs, and recurrent neural networks, RNNs, are often used in conjunction with GANs and VAS to generate new data samples. For example, CNNs can be used as the generator and discriminator networks in a GAN, enabling the generation of realistic images. RNNs, on the other hand, can be used to generate sequential data, such as text or audio. The techniques leveraged in deep learning for generative modeling include 1. Neural Network Architecture Design The design of the neural network architecture plays a crucial role in the generation of new data samples. The choice of architecture, such as the number of layers, the number of neurons, and the activation functions, significantly impacts the quality of the generated data. 2. Loss Function Optimization The choice of loss function and the optimization algorithm used to minimize the loss function significantly impact the performance of the generative model. Common loss functions used in generative modeling include mean squared error, cross entropy, and adversarial loss. 3. Hyperparameter tuning Hyperparameter tuning is critical in deep learning based generative modeling. Hyperparameters, such as learning rate, batch size, and number of epochs, need to be carefully tuned to achieve optimal results. 4. Regularization techniques Regularization techniques such as dropout and weight decay, are used to prevent overfitting and improve the generalization capabilities of the generative model. 5. Data augmentation Data augmentation techniques, such as random cropping and flipping, are used to increase the diversity of the training data and improve the robustness of the generative model. Deep learning-based generative models have numerous applications in various domains, including 1. Data augmentation Generative models can be used to augment existing datasets, enabling the generation of new data samples that resemble the original data. 2. Style transfer Generative models can be used to transfer styles from one dataset to another, enabling the generation of new data samples that combine the characteristics of multiple datasets. 3. Image-to-image -image translation 
Generative models can be used to translate images from one domain to another, enabling the generation of new data samples that resemble the original data. 4. Text-to-image synthesis Generative models can be used to generate images from textual descriptions, enabling the generation of new data samples that resemble the original data. 5. Audio synthesis Generative models can be used to generate audio samples from textual descriptions or musical scores, enabling the generation of new data samples that resemble the original data. In conclusion, deep learning plays a vital role in the development and application of generative models, such as GANs and VAS. The techniques leveraged in deep learning, including neural network architecture design, loss function optimization, hyperparameter tuning, regularization techniques, and data augmentation, enable the generation of new and unique data samples that resemble existing ones. The applications of deep learning-based generative models are vast and have the potential to revolutionize various domains, including computer vision, natural language processing, and audio synthesis.